how to avoid the donut hole. Go to Walmart or any of the big box stores to avoid the donut hole. And this video will share some information with you on how to do that. In this video, we're going to share how to avoid getting in the donut hole. You can go to Walmart or any of the big box stores to avoid the donut hole. Don't present your Part D Medicare card if you are purchasing generic copies of your prescription drugs. Don't show your card. Pay the $4 for the 30-day supply or $10 for the 90-day supply. If you are using the drug on an ongoing basis, always ask for the 90-day supply. It's a lot cheaper. Most people don't know that in 2014, the $2,850 limit before you enter the donut hole is the total cost of the prescriptions between you and the insurance company. That means if you're paying only $4, but the company is paying maybe $400, then you're getting $400 closer to your donut hole, even though you only spent $4. To save even more money, ask the doctor to prescribe a double dosage that you can then split in half that would last you twice as long. And you could get a simple uh, pill splitter at any of the big shops. Here's a list of the retail prescription program list at Walmart. They're basically the same list everywhere where genetics are sold. Pause the video, take a second, find your drug, and make sure that it's on the list. I hope you're looking and taking your time. Did you see your drug? Save yourself from the donut hole. Use the small little technique that many people don't know about. But we at insuredmeds.com are bringing to you because that's our responsibility to you. Worried about Medicare? Go to our website or type into YouTube insuredmeds.com or call us at 845-380-5809 for info and free quote. Si hablamos español.